Hi, I'm Richard Von Busack, film critic for Metro Newspapers. Today, Friday, March 11th, is the Day of the Writer, a tradition at CineQuest of seminars and celebration. Part one at the San Jose State University Theater at 10 a.m. is Crafting the Heart of Sci-Fi, the Story. Howard Suber is the founding chair of the Film and Television Producers Program at UCLA. He will discuss the unique problems and opportunities facing the sci-fi screenwriter. At 1 p.m., a forum discussion by Steve Cooden of the X-Men TV series and Paul Chitlick of the new Twilight Zone. The moderator is sometimes De Anza guest lecturer, Robert Phelps. Finally at 3.30, David Wed Peoples, co-screenwriter of Blade Runner, will meet James D'Alessandro, whose script 1906 about the San Francisco earthquake is about to become Pixar's first live action film. Would you rather watch movies than write them? Well then, there's one of the best at a venue worthy of it too. F.W. Murnau's Nosferatu, playing in a 35 millimeter print at the California Theater. An unauthorized version of Dracula made before the count went into the public domain, Nosferatu is a terrific first silent film for those who have never seen one, and it's also an acknowledged masterpiece from those who know silent cinema well. I'm Richard Von Busack. Thanks for watching. And on the set of Smith Brothers Talk Film, we were joined by Candace Reiser, director of the short film Protect the Nation. Basically, in 2008, there was a, a wave of xenophobic attacks against foreigners in South Africa. It tells the story of this, but in 16 minutes, uh, through the eyes of a child and, and what that is like to, to witness and be a part of. I wanted to use the camera kind of like an imaginary friend for the little boy to be drawn into his world and actually see the world that he's living in through the eyes of a child. He's really full of love, but he doesn't have anybody who will nurture everything that he could be. And I think of the character uh, as a little bit like a flower that's growing out of a, out of a garbage heap. And if you see something like that, that's kind of a miracle. And that's something that needs to be protected. Protect the Nation screens Saturday, 1.30 p.m. at Camera 12.